Hello and welcome to the show. Today I'm going to be playing some Trackmania. Yes, this is the new Trackmania that has recently come out. I think it is kind of a bit of a remake of Nations, if I remember correctly. Uh, now, I like Trackmania. I'm not very good at it. And this is the thing, Trackmania is kind of one of these very, very specialist games almost. And... I enjoyed Turbo, I played quite a bit of Turbo, I played sort of Canyon and some of the other ones. Um, it's a curious game, it's a curious game. So, we're going to just do the kind of single player -y stuff at the moment, if you will. There's a whole bunch of things that uh, oh, that you can do here. Uh, so, there's going to be updated with content as the, the seasons go on and, and all of that kind of stuff. So, we're at Summer 2020, we've done these is on some of the easier levels basically apparently I haven't done very well on level 10 over here uh, sure let's go have a look what level was this uh, I just go play around a little bit get a feel for the game see what was going on and uh, all of that sort of stuff so we can go for, for opponents uh, they'll spawn in some ghosts that are kind of around your level there'll be, some, there'll be like a quick ghost there'll be a medium ghost and some easier ghost or you can just drive around on your own that's fine uh, Trackmania is a lot about the kind of time trialing, if you will. It's about trying to go as fast as possible. Oh dear! Uh, trying to beat the clock on what is a pretty wibbly technical, uh, interesting stage. Apparently, oh no, that's the wrong button. Uh, where are my ghost modey cars gone? Uh, ghosts have gone off, apparently. Uh, don't know where the ghosts have gone. Sorry, I like having the ghosts, I like having something to chase. Um, I don't know why the ghosts have got turned off. Uh, but apparently it has. Never mind. I've done a thing. Uh, we're going to get camera back where I want to. I don't want to be on the old uh, first person. First person is kind of interesting, but uh, not really how to drive track mania, shall we say. Um, oh, God. If you've played track mania game before, handling-wise, is going to be immediately familiar. It's not I say it's not not to me. I'm not really used to this sort of driving. It's very different. We have some different services. I don't remember ever going up against ice stuff. It's one of the ones I've played. However, we have got ice to contend with. Uh, this section, I'm not really 100% sure what I'm doing here, if I'm honest with you. Uh, there's definitely a knack to going much quicker over there. Uh, <laughs> it's, it's all about sort of finding out how to go quickly around these courses. There's all sorts of clever little tricks. I mean, that I have completed here. Uh, we didn't really do very well. Uh, so yeah, it's kind of trying to chase after the ghost times around here, trying to go quicker and quicker on these stages that get more and more nasty as time goes on. Uh, no in-air control for us to uh, play around with here. Uh, we can chuck the car in and slide it around through here if we want. Um, Oh, a little bit because we're on the dirt. On the tarmac, the car's got a lot of grip. You don't really slide around. Oh, definitely not on that camera angle. Uh, <laughs> didn't mean to press the button anyway, just started changing. Uh, yeah, on the tarmac, uh, you have a lot of grip. You don't really slide the cars around. I don't know. There was definitely a way. Oh, I drove around here. I got a huge amount of speed coming off of this bank section. I don't quite know how I did it. Um, like coming up here, I managed, one time I managed to get so much speed I ended up hitting into the side of the uh, sort of bridge bit over there. How on earth did I ever manage that? Four. I don't know, I'm guessing if you get a really good run up there, oh, you can probably jump through the little tube and gap and, well, this has not gone to plan really, has it? That was shockingly bad. You get the idea. I could spend a long time on this one. We're just going to go on to the next map. Apparently my brain cannot figure out how, how to go quickly around there. Uh, and that's, that's, the, that's, the, that's the thing with this. There are tricks. There are tricks to all of these different stages uh, that you will learn. Uh, super turbo followed by slow motion. Cool. Okay. Oh, good God, that's a lot of speed! Right, so now we're starting to get to the more tricky circuits, <laughs> in which that is a thing that is going to happen. Hello, floor. It's fine. Uh, okay, let's try again. So it's super speed, then you do like a little slow-mo, and then you do a little more of a speed, and then you weave your way through here. Now, the trick I think here is going to get the car lower, 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 lower. There we go. Now, we're skidding around a little bit. Uh-oh. I don't think I'm supposed to do that. It's fine. We're hovering? Ah. We are parked. Not quite sure how we... Right. <laughs> a lot goes on really quickly there. I'm kind of curious about what's the rest of this. Oh, God. Are we now on Slippy Slippy? Maybe we're on Slippy Slippy. I'm not actually sure. We might be on the Slippy Slippy surfaces. Uh, slippy Slippy rule right? Uh, no, that's a weird... I can't figure out what surface that is. That's definitely not the Slippy stuff. Uh, well, another super turbo. This is kind of... Oh, hello. Hello. Get away from the wall. Okay. I don't know where the car went. I think it pinged off to space. Yes, it did. Uh, so I'll often use 
the first couple of runs. These are a little bit of sighting runs, if you like. I know I'm going to crash. You know, we know there's going to be accidents. There's going to be little uh, bumps and whatnot along the way. I should have gone that way now to let me know where I'm going. There's going to be little bumps and accidents because you're just figuring out where the course goes, what you can and can't do. Uh, get off of the wall there. Oh, that's more like it. That's more like it. Uh, okay, up on the banking we go. Keep the cart nice and low through here. We're staying full throttle all the way. Oh, oh, we've gone really far. <laughs> We got a little too far. Help! Help! Things have got awry. <laughs> That's not what I'm supposed to have got at all. Okay, so there's two. Well, there's ways to finish that race, and then there's ways to finish that race, and we went for the well. Oh, alternative. That's a ping off the wall. Let's not do that one. Um, yeah, this is one of those games where you'll reset a lot trying to go for that quick time. Apparently, for me, we'll reset a lot just trying to get to the finish line in one piece. Uh, right. So up on the up on the wall try and make sure we can get off of it. We got off it way too late there. Uh, we will get the car down, but we're going to go for a tumble. Oh, can we style it out here? No, we styled it out in a manner of speaking. The style was upside down and out of... That is the fail race way. It was upside down and out of control. That is one way to style it out. Uh, Christ. Alright, let's go for a try and set us up. Nope, not that way. <laughs> okay, I, don't, I got through here bloody first time. We got through here first time flat out and everything was all good. Uh, now, can I do it to save my life? Nope. Uh, right. Oh no, we pinged off the wall. We might still get away with this. We can get the vehicle nice and low on that on that wall ride. Oh, look at that. Now we're set up really nicely for this section, so we can float our way across. Nicely does it. Uh, then we're back up onto the wall over here. Uh, we've got more super turbo. Oh. Oh. No. Oh. Finish line, finish line, finish line. There we go. <laughs> We, we turtled our way across the finish line. <laughs> you know what? I will take it. If we finish a race on our roof, I would generally say that is a pretty damn good way to go. It's a very fair racing approved way to manage to fly your way across the finish line on your roof. I mean, this is one of those things. I think with Trackmania, it's very easy to... Where the hell am I going? Oh, we're going over this way, aren't we? Okay, that's fine. Trackmania is one of those games that's really easy to spend 20 minutes just trying to do that one stage, getting faster and faster, because it drives well. While it's not a handling model that I am all too familiar with, uh, that's not the fault of the game, that's just on, that's on me. Um, I just haven't had a huge amount of experience with Trackmania. It is a very nice handling model to be to be working with. Yes, it's full-on arcade and, and so on. Oh dear! And it is going to take some getting used to if you don't drive this sort of game. But it is a good, solid hand model. It's a, oh, a rewarding one when you do get things right. It's going to take some learning. I mean, I've seen the sort of professional, the really fast, like the world record holders and some of the stuff they do with this game is unbelievable. Um, where the hell are we going now? Not there, are we? No, we are. We're supposed to go... How did I... I am a fool! This is quite a long, a long road. Most of these stages tend to be sort of 30, 40 seconds. Uh, oh... Right, okay, so we know where we're going here. Now, oh god, get the vehicle slowed down. I'm sure you can be an awful lot quicker through here than me. I'm not going to be setting any world records, as I said. Uh, so we kind of want to go down here, and then we want to go up here. That's the ticket. Slide it about a little bit. Uh, I'm not quite sure where we go anymore. This is why we do the sighting runs, so that when we go out going, oh, full, full throttle when we're going all the way for it, we kind of roughly know where we're going. Avoid the trees, please. Uh, we'll get away with sliding about a little more on the dirt here. Now, there's coming up towards a loopy loopy bit. Let's do the loopy loopy bit and let's not fall off the map again. Uh, right, where are we going? Oh, Christ, there's no grip up here because we're on sort of like a dirt loopy loopy bit. Bloody hell. Okay. Ooh, we're quite a number of seconds down for that. I'm sure it could get... I'm sure we'll go back at some point and do all of that. That's a fun little circuit. Uh, see, I like some of the... I'll say some of the power-ups we've got going on. I like the sort of stick to the ceiling, what's some sort of floaty stuff to- Oh, I like these stages, but I'm so bad at them. Uh, so, uh, do you want to do some bobsleigh? I mean, there's good variety, there's all sorts of different challenges for the for the vehicles here. Um, you know, you've got some that are going to involve loops, you've got some that are going to involve a bobsleigh course. Oh dear, oh no, 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 that's not- Oh, no, wait, hold on. Hold on, we styled it out, it's all good. Where the hell are we going here? Oh, I can definitely be faster. Definitely some knack to go in quicker. Ooh. 
That's all right through here. We can carry that level of speed. Now we're going to go and fling our car forward. Uh, I don't know what the knack for cornering on the snow is. Not this. Not this. Mayday. It's a wall. Okay, there's definitely a different way of taking that. I thought maybe if we let it just kind of slide about, we could keep up momentum, but it just didn't really turn enough. Maybe we're going to have to be a bit more aggressive with that. We've made it to the finish line. It wasn't... We got the bronze medal. You know, a def I mean, definitely can get silver. Considering we skidded away down our bobsleigh, down the bobsleigh course on our roof, I feel like a silver should be at least achievable in this. Uh, there's a lot, of, there's a lot of tricks if you're going to want to go quickly on this, and that's okay. You know, so, so that's okay. It's nice to have a game that's going to give you a different kind of a challenge. <laughs> Where am I going over here? Christ, that's not what we wanted to be doing whatsoever. Right, try again, shall we? Uh, to We'll slot the vehicle through here. Try and get some speed up on the way down. We'll brush the wall to smidge through all of that. Uh, right, here we go. Don't flip over the edge of the circuit this time around. I said don't flip over the edge of the circuit. Now we've managed to get turbo boost backwards. That's not how it works. <laughs> I mean, there's probably... You could... Probably some very quick drivers on some courses will end up doing some sneak... Uh, this is some ridiculous stuff, like jumping of... Uh, you can, like, jump between bits of the course, and make, as long as he still gets the checkpoints, all that kind of stuff. There's some really cool stuff uh, that very quick drivers can do, of which I am not. I'm not the person you come to if you want to watch the really quick speedruns of this game, because uh, I uh, barely know what I'm doing. Uh, as you can see, as we bump into the wall on a medium difficulty sort of circuit here. Uh, now, what if... I feel like we've got to try and cut in way tighter through here. Uh, come on. Come on. <laughs> Don't really know. There might be a better way of doing that still. We've got a lot of speed coming across the finish line. It's 42. Uh, we will get... How close are we? Uh, you know, let's have one more go. Now, this is the thing. This is the, that's the great thing about Trackmania. Is it is really addictive for this one more go. Let's try and get that gold medal. On so, I mean, some courses I look at and go, no, you know what? I don't know what I'm doing here. I'm not going to be able to do that. If I stop brushing into the bloody wall. No, one, one more go. <laughs> it's the problem bit. One more go. No bumping into the wall. Uh, here, we want to kind of yank the car across there, because it's going to start sliding as it transitions to the tarmac, but that's fine. Uh, here... Oh, that's too quick. That's too quick. It's too quick. Oh. No, we're going to be... We, I say, we're, we're going to stick to the one more go. I'm sure we'll come back at some point. At some point, I'll go and do the uh, gold medals for this stuff. Again, remember, these are the middle difficulty circuits that we're doing here. Uh, oh, I was supposed to have turned a bit more. I have found Antri... Many and trees, in fact, and a cactus. I don't think I'm supposed to be over here, <laughs> particularly. Nope. Right. Okay, so we've got to fire the vehicle, hit that, and then we've got to like, steer it back this way. Uh, we have a little bit of in-air control with that power-up thing activated. Um, oh, dear. Okay, maybe more brakes. Maybe more braking is required there. Hello, wall. Everything's gone all super slow-mo and peculiar. What is going on with this level? This level's all timey-wimey, wibbly-wobbly, and all of that sort of stuff uh, that we've got to deal with. That's new. Not dealt with that before. Oh, bugger me. Right. I did... I lifted slightly to try and set it up, thinking that was a good idea, but it wasn't. We've got to actually jump far enough so we get on the downward bit. There we go. So, here... Ah, uh, I know what we did. I know what I did. Ooh, okay, no, I don't need to go on the brakes there. I think I've seen what I need to do. It's, there is a horn. There, I don't think there's a way to look back. Um, particularly. However, uh, I think if you want to get that, where am I going? Anybody have an answer for me? Uh, I don't know. We're making this up as we go along. We're going to find the grass. Hello. Oh, let's go over there. I feel like there's a shortcut somewhere to that one. We clonked the wall pretty hard. Hmm. Okay, we can definitely improve. So, what it looks like to me here is if we want to go do this... So, we don't really want to slow down if we don't have to. So what if we aimed for there, like so, and then we get a little bit of in-air control. Just don't hit the wall, don't hit the wall. Come back, come back, come back, come back, come back. There we go. Minding the wall, minding the... Oh, kind of minding the thing. Uh, we've not really got any speed going on now. I feel like the way you want to go with this as well is you want to go... Oh, no, I haven't got the momentum to do this. Uh... <laughs> Okay, the idea is there. The execution was poor. The idea was there. Not quite the execution. Hey, we were learning. That's that's the important thing here, is that uh, there is some learning going on. All right. Get the car settled here. Ooh! What 
the physics happened in that one? I do not know. Uh, we are four seconds down. Okay, that's not going to work either. It's that one more try. Uh, is what we're at at the moment. We are at that one more try. Okay, so we've got to keep, we've got to keep it flat through there. Right, through there. Oh no no no. Okay, maybe we want to have a little bit of a lift so we don't overshoot. We should overshoot too much there. We need a small lift. It's a balancing act between going quickly and, well, actually landing it properly. Maybe we have a little bit of a lift here. We can still go through there. God, I mean, that was a small lift and that made a world of difference. It seems like that feels pretty good to me. Uh, whether that is actually going to turn out to be pretty good, I don't know. Well, I wanted to try and go all the way to the far side, because I think that's a boost pad to get to the finish line quicker. We might not quite make that, but that's okay. Uh, we need to sort of slide it up much further. Boop! Hey! We got a gold! Our first gold medal of the day. Uh, and there we go. I quite, that's quite fun. That was quite a fun little, um, little course, I must say. Uh, let's go see what this one entails as having to do. And now, another thing... What the... What the... What? Wait, what? 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 What the... What is going on here? Does anybody have an answer? Not that. What is going on here? So, I can see the finish line. I think I'm not supposed to be going to it yet. Am I supposed to be just going around here, maybe? I presume so. Oh, maybe we go to the finish line from the other side. Okay, I'll try to get a bit creative. Uh, what I was going to say, yes, this being a Track Mania game, uh, there is a Track Creator for this, so you can create your own custom courses. This is where things get a little bit funky. Now, I'm just driving the game-made ones. This is just this season's uh, sort of like single-player races, if you will. I'm presuming they'll be changing uh, every season. There is a track of the day as well that you can uh, challenge. There's multiplayer racing and all of that. Uh, however, this is where things get a little bit peculiar for the game, because what I'm currently doing here at the moment, this is all free. Uh, you can download the game and you can play this side of things uh, for free. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like... Oh, God. I don't like slow-mo and boosts and all of this. <gasps> oh! About to have a cough mid-jump. Uh, we pinged our way through. Should we have another go at that? Sure. I'll have one more go. We'll see if we can get close to gold. Uh, anyway, yes. You can play the time trials. You can play the single-player stuff. You can play this uh, for free. However, you want to be creating a circuit, you need a subscription. Which, I'll be honest, I'm not sold on as a way to do a Track Mania game. Look, sell us a game, let us play a game, and all of that sort of stuff is probably really the way to be going. Now, for me personally, I've never been, I've never been the biggest track creator when it comes to these. I don't really know what I'm doing. I enjoy driving on them, um, but yeah, I'm not necessarily the biggest track creator myself, but that is a big important part of Track Mania, being able to create and customise your own circuit. Now, I don't know why we've gone for a... Uh, I actually don't technically use it, I don't want to call it a subscription model, but it is. Um, I don't know. It seems a little bit funky to me. It does seem a little bit weird. Oh no, I completely pissed. I was on such a good run. Oh, I missed. I just ran too wide. That is the f infuriating thing when you've got a really good run up until like, the final quarter or whatever and you just piss it away at the death. Uh, that's quite a good transition, I think. Oh no, apparently not. Maybe we've got too much airtime. Possibly. Anyway, yeah, the subscription thing is a little bit weird. Um, a way of doing things. I would just rather a, a straight up here as a game. Here you go. Kind of a kind of a jobby. I guess it's you know kind of nice that. Uh, oh no, this is not going quite as quickly as the last one. Not at all. Uh, yeah, if you're just like me, more interested in just just the driving aspect of things, then you know, well, the game is free. And I would I would recommend it because it is good fun. It's a really different sort of driving challenge. It's a uh, often infuri. It's, I say it's an often infuriating one. That's probably the, the wrong word. It's not infuriating because the handling is good. Uh, when you have a handling model as consistent as this, it's not... Yeah, it's, it's not as infuriating as that I am not good enough. That's the thing, okay? I know that it's me. It's nothing to do with the game or the car or anything like that. I know it's, it's, all, it's all down to me because the handling is consistent, the handling is good, and all of that. Uh, so it's about me getting better, or the player getting better, if you will. Um, on these very, very challenging circuits. And when you get that perfect run, like that earlier run was looking, I say perfect run, it's not perfect for me, you know, relative speaking and all that. Uh, it is immensely, immensely rewarding. And some of these circuits are really good fun. You've got these really intricate... Uh, no, still not quite got that right. I think I got it better, though. Is this good enough? Here we go. Come on, car. Come on, car. Come on, car. Oh, bing! 
Hey, gold medal. <laughs> we did it. We did it. Um, yeah, I would certainly, of course, certainly recommend giving this a download. Have a little bit of a play around. Yes, I don't like the uh, monetary model, so to speak, with this one. But the game is very, very good fun. I am not very good at it, and it does take some getting used to. Nope. <laughs> it's not gonna, that's not going to happen. Uh, just took a little bit of getting used to. Uh, but as I said, I like a different sort of challenge. You know, I like my, I like racing games that uh, give me something different uh, to try and be doing. Oh, we got so lucky with the bumping there. <gasps> no, we're not going to make it. <laughs> and Trackmania certainly, yeah, certainly does that one. Um, at some point, I may well. So I, I was sent code to this one, and I was given access to the track creation stuff. I might have a go at building some circuits, see what I can come up with. Uh, I like I like this already. I like having the jumps to try and take shortcuts and stuff. Where the bloody hell am I going here? Uh, oh, okay, we're going over this way. Sure, I can do that. I might have a go see if we can build some circuits and all that kind of thing as well. If people are interested in seeing more track mania, maybe I'll get a little bit better at this one. Christ, we've got a lot of speed going on down there, and now I've got stuck. All right, we're going to get there to the end of this. Well, if the video is like 20 minutes longer, at the, or 20, is there another 20 minutes to go in this video, it means I've not done very well at this. Uh, <laughs> Oh, that was too much speed. It's rare It's rare that I end up taking too much speed in a track mania. More often than not, I am nowhere near fast enough for some of these sections. Right. Ah, oh, there we go. That was spot on there. That was lovely. Well, not quite lovely, actually. I don't quite know where I missed out on the speed. That's kind of good. Kind of iffy. Kind of crashed. Okay, I take it back. <laughs> the difference between getting that spot on too fast and too slow is absolutely tiny here. Uh, that, see, that's too quick. We actually hit the top of it. How did I, guys? Really, really fine margins. It's fiddly. It's very fiddly, but then of course, very rewarding as well. Right, that looks good to me. Uh, that was pretty, pretty spot on. Now, position for the jump. That's too slow, actually, through there. We might have to go. For, let's finish the bloody course. Let's not go for perfection. Yes, I can sense. I can sense that 20 minutes remaining still going on here. Right, that was good. That was what we want. That was absolutely what we want. Now, this one here, not that, not that, not that, not that. Bugger me. If I'm quick enough, I can get away with that. But I wasn't quick enough. How do I get quick enough? I guess maybe sort of minimal steering through this sort of section. Oh, a little bit twisted. A little bit twisted in the air, but that's okay. A bit more aggressive with the steering there. Oh, I thought we were going to get over the barrier. No game. Don't, 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 don't do this. We just wanted to have a nice ending. I mean, it'd be nice if we finished on a gold medal. Not gonna lie. Would be nice. Here we go. Right. Got the jump. Okay, got a little bobble on the landing. That's fine. We're gonna throw the car. There we go. That's what we like. Again, not 100% spot on. We had a little bit of a bobble. Uh, oh, car. There we go. Okay, got a little bit, little bit carried away in all of that. Now, we've got to be careful with coming down this hill. We only pick up a million miles an hour. Uh, oh, brakes. Uh, <laughs> Uh, don't know where I'm going. We're just gonna fly the car. And there is all sorts of like little movable bits on the vehicles, which are quite fun. Ooh, I was not prepared for the sudden speed boost. Oh, bugger me. Where are we going, game? Please don't. So, okay, if, if you get that one right, I suspect you land on the downward, slant, uh, downward sloping bit and maintain all your momentum. That's where the finish line is. Okay, that's kind of cool. That's a fun little route. Oh, we got a gold medal as well. Huh. I wanted to finish on a gold medal. I'm thoroughly surprised. Apparently we did that one quite neatly. I felt like there was way more time in that as well. But, uh, <laughs> there we go. That's a little bit of a look at Trackmania. As I said, it is free to do a lot of the sort of driving stuff. I do recommend you go and give it a try. The handling model is not for everybody. It is very different. It's a very different sort of a challenge. That's okay. I, you know, I always like doing, having a different sort of racing experience, a racing challenge, so to speak. And this can certainly, can certainly do that. I mean, this is only some of the mid-level mid courses. There's the whole load, the whole wonderful world of player-made meanness and some of the really top difficulty level ones that I'll probably have a very big death on. So, there we go. Might come back to some more Trackmania if people would like to see some more of this game. Do let me know in the comment section. That, though, is going to be it from me. Thank you all very much for watching, and until next time, a uh, goodbye.